It is pick, win, and drive time. Amazingly enough, week seven of the football season is upon us. Mark Malusis with you, being joined here by one of the partners in New York Auto Giant, Michael Brown. What's going on, Michael? How's everything? We got a win, Moose. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> there you go, Michael. As uh, Michael last week selected, the Jets lay in the two and a half at home against the Indianapolis Colts. They covered, they won, and that means Eileen Garfin from uh, Atlantic Audi is a winner as well. What does Eileen get? Tailgate for you and 10 of your friends. A shot at a two-year lease on a Hyundai Elantra at the end of the football season, right? Yeah, let's get it going get now. Let's that, get rolling. Right? So that's what we do each and every week. Go to nyautogiant.com, register. It is absolutely free. Free. Cost you nothing. What do you get? You register. Michael is going to make a selection against the spread. Does it each and every week. you got to register each and every week. If he's correct, we pick a winner. Tailgate you and 10 of your friends. Shy you two-year lease on an automobile end of the football season. Doesn't get any better than that. All right, Michael. Jets victorious against the Colts on Sunday. Got to love what you saw from your squad. I love, I love what I saw from the squad, and I love what I saw from some of the reserves. I mean, they were banged up. Both, both sides were banged yep. up, let's face it. But some of these guys came out and played extremely well. Bilal Powell, who was uh, getting some extra carries because Correll's a little banged up. Ankle and injury, yep. How about uh, Terrell Pryor coming in when an unmo went down? Played very, very some, well. Some big catches, but, I mean, all the talk is about Sam Darnold. Isn't how it? great is he? I mean, he, he is a calm, cool, and collected, Mike. He's reserved, and they always, the, this word unflappable, which I don't think I ever heard in my life. Now I hear it every week. Yes. I mean, he really is. He's coming into his own. He's getting protection. Kelvin Beecham. Unbelievable. Highest rated offensive tackle in the NFL. I don't know where that came from. I guess maybe it's contagious. I don't know. But you got two inside linebackers and Avery Williamson and Darren Lee that are playing really, really well. So there are pieces to this puzzle that are stepping up. There are guys that we didn't see step up last year stepping up and some additions to the team that weren't around last year that are stepping up. So uh, I got to give credit to the coach. This was this was a must win game for him. It was. This was a real, real telltale game. Does he have this locker room intact? Can he get a win streak going? And now you're going into a game, you're home again, so you have that going for you. And you're going against a team who's having some issues. Yes, you in know, the, the Minnesota Vi Vikings. The, the Vikings were, were allegedly Super Bowl possibilities, playoff bound, and they got the $90 million QB we didn't get the shot at. Who did not even want to take a visit didn't with the Jets. Didn't take the visit. So maybe there's some guys on the defensive side of the ball for the Jets that might want to say hello I think hello they got a shot. Sunday. I think they can beat Minnesota on Sunday. Listen, uh, they're a home dog. I get it, but I think they can beat the Vikings. They're a home dog. They're gonna have to do the same thing that they did effectively the last two weeks: run the football, use both your backs, run the football, give Darnell Darnold his opportunities when he sees them down the field to use it. But you gotta control the clock. You gotta run the football. And the Jets have got the uh, sports fan in this marketplace by the ears because the Giants are a one and five football team and going nowhere. Yeah, well, that's a tough one. Yeah, that's I mean, it really is right team. now when you look at. Everything with the sub, uh, distractions from Odell Beckham Jr., Shermer, Eli Manning, cat calls for his job. I mean, everything's got to arrive for the Giants through the first six weeks. You can't weeks. be punching air conditioners. you got to be poised on the sidelines. They're definitely losing their way. It's, 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 it's tough sledding, but I'm going to tell you something about the Giants, and we'll talk about it in a minute. They do have pieces. Saquon, they do. Saquon Barkley. It's special. He's as good as it gets. Yeah, he really is. It's the running back spot. All right, before we get Michael's selection, give you an opportunity to win here week seven. Michael, you guys at NY Auto Giant do a fantastic job getting outreach into the community. What are you doing with uh, Kayla McCandles? We talked about it a little bit last week, but the outreach continues, correct? Yeah, we're excited. We're now into the into the meat of the month of October. We're almost to the middle of the month, and we're having a month-long sale in a bunch of our stores to raise money for uh, Kaylin's family. She's one of seven children, a uh, wonderful family out of Lindenhurst, Long Island. And, um, you know, Kaylin's fighting cancer, and um, we want to help her in that fight, join her in that fight and uh, try and be part of it with her. So we're going to support them, uh, this family all month long in October. So proceeds from every sale are going to go to the family. Well, that's a tremendous job. But you and everyone, in, all the number of dealerships and certainly thoughts and prayers are with Kaylin Absolutely. and her entire family as she continues the brave fight. Um, all right, Michael, where are we going to go here week seven? Where are you going to go? I think you gave us a little bit of a yeah. lean. I think you're well, looking toward Monday Night Football, yeah, Giants, Yeah, we're going to keep right? it local. All yeah. right, you're going to keep it local. So it's not going to be Jets, Vikings, Giants plus six on the road against Atlanta. Yeah, listen, I know everybody's down on the Giants, and people might not like what I'm going to say, but I'm going to tell you this. I'm still behind Eli Manning. I think there's so many haters out there. 
don't ask Eli to do something he's never done before. He is a drop back passer. Okay, he does not move with a pocket. You gotta protect him. And if you can protect him, he's gonna execute. He's shown it time and time again. I am still in with Eli. I think that they're gonna be able to move the ball on this Atlanta Falcon team. They showed us last Sunday, although they did get a win, their defense has some major holes, some major issues. They're not stopping Saquon Barkley. And if they can get their run game going, I think Eli's gonna do some damage down the field with Shepard, with Beckham, and I think they're gonna be able to move the football can they squeak out a win on the road? It's desperation time. Maybe, maybe not, but I certainly think they're going to keep it close enough. Giants plus six. Michael Stolen, Eli Believer. There you go. That's his week seven pick. Now it's up to you. Go to myautogiant.com. Register. It's absolutely free. Costs you nothing. If Michael's correct, we pick your name. Tailgate for you and 10 of your friends. Shy two-year lease. Hyundai Elantra. End of the football season. Giants plus six. Week seven pick. Michael, good luck to you. Thanks, Mark. You got it. And good luck to you.